what up guys um nerd gamer here today and welcome back to a brand new video and this video is going to be an update video of some california roleplay so there was a situation last yesterday or the following day whenever this video gets released there was a a big argument you know i don't know how this started and you know i was not aware until further notice until further later you know it it was a hard day, you know, we try our best and solution to resolve this, and now most of my staff team is gone, joining a brand new other servers and new servers, you know, and mostly everybody has split apart because of this argument, you know, this occurred on 8 eight to nineteen uh twenty twenty which was on a Monday I b no on a Tuesday and it was a hard day for us you know I f recently found out on one of my regular members or one of the staff members sent me a picture of them starting a brand new server called Infinity Roleplay now they were all backstage recruiting they were doing all that and uh, you know it was hard you know I, I told I, I confessed to them you know I'm like so now what you know these are all leaving they all left and you gotta understand not all roleplay servers are not all roleplay servers are correct okay and right now we're going through difficult times like I said and I told them the reason why some people left is because they didn't play their part as an administrator. And I mostly told them, you don't come here to get a staff role. You come here to have fun and all that. And they almost see uh, agreed and all that. And then later on they said, why don't you just pay your administrators? So I'm like, no, you guys volunteer your time. And I'm trying to make things right and all that. But at the circumstances, everybody's just getting mad at each other. Because I actually found out they had a roleplay server going on right now. Or, I don't even know if it's good right now. But, there's a roleplay server. They made, like I said, Infinity Roleplay. All my administrators were there. And some of my members. So I had to go blacklist that community. And then later on, everybody left and they wanted to come back to my server. So everybody came back. Then they most, And then another argument came back. And I said, okay... Let me fix these problems. You know, and I said it again, not every server is great and all that. And, you know, I feel bad for all my members that left already, all my administrators actually. Like, I'm taking this into heart. I actually missed them. They were good people and all that. And yeah, <clears throat> I go through difficult times as well. You know, i busy with family. Um, this pandemic, you know, it's just, uh, you know, been hard. 2020 has just been the worst year so far, you know, and it's very difficult, like I said, you know. Um, I deeply miss them. If they're watching this video, hope they do. Alabaster, Shane... Luke, um, Navulator, and other staff. And I'm taking this into heart. I actually guys missed you guys. I still have some of the old my, my old staff back. You know, got them back, and I'm glad they're back. You know, because I'm actually happy. You know, it's just the circumstances. You know, of what occurred at that time. And, you know, I, I deeply told them already, I'm busy. And they understand I'm busy, you know. I go, I get over 30 DMs and then I get over like, you know, six six meetings a day. Mostly every single day. People that want to merge and all that. And it's very difficult to maintain, you know. It's very difficult to maintain. And all that. And I'm just trying to do my best, like I said, to keep up and maintain the server, you know. 
and going to recent time right now at 620 uh, I mean 628 slash 2020 slash uh, 8 slash 20 slash 2020 there we go well actually this happened last night so it not really matter but you know these this individual broke uh, a, a rule we have called David's Law, which if you guys don't know David's Law, it's because of a kid named David in real in RL, in real life, that actually uh, called bullying, cyber bullying, and all that. Okay, so now he goes and starts talking, uh, starts talking crap about the other members, starts, you know, disrespect, disrespecting him, and, you know, this happened on a night I was asleep already until right now I just get further noticed on the 20th of August at probably three three o'clock three three something you know this individual you know started saying things that the guy which I know it didn't happen you know he starts talking about his dead mom starts talking about his you know Suicide, you know, make it more drama. And I take suicide very, very seriously, you know. And I tell him, don't, don't do this, you know. I told, and I told him, you don't come here as a, sta you don't come here to get a staff role. You come here to have fun and role playing. He says, nah, but I'm not having fun. And I, I clearly understand. Yeah. There's FRP in every server. There's FRP in every 5M server, Xbox, you know, whatever. You know, but you guys gotta understand at that moment, you guys gotta start, they gotta behave, and you know, it's trying to blame things on my headboard, which my headboard never did, you know. And yeah, this guy named Brady, yeah, he's, he was a good guy, but he had multiple complaints on, on cause he, when he was a staff member, he had multiple complaints as well. So we had to do something with the chain of command. Like I said, a lot of members left because of an argument. And I, I actually feel bad, you know, I actually feel bad. And if they watch this video, like I said, I hope they join back and help me out a lot. You know, I had thoughts about deleting the server yesterday or the following day, whenever this video gets released. There's a lot of drama and, you know, I couldn't take it no more. But, you know, all, the, all my other members said, don't delete it. You work hard. I'm like, you know what? I did. So I'm going to keep it and you know try to make it more improved so I hope it gets more improved in this situation and matter so hope it does and yeah hopefully it does you know I don't want no more drama and yeah the roleplay dramas from every server like it's very hard you know and yeah I'm talking about the truth about my server right now it's not that simple we started off last year then we ended it last year as well and then you know there's multiple previous staff members that actually left as well because of the server and FRP and all these situations but you gotta you guys gotta understand now you guys come here to have fun and enjoy your time and become a proud member of California Roleplay. Okay. Um. Otherwise, if not, then you could just leave. Cause some people join and then they get bored and then just nuke the server or nuke, uh, nuke the server. Sorry, I uh, grieve the server or session. You know, and we're trying our best to control these crowds and all that. So, yeah. Otherwise, you know. We do have a ban appeal server. We do have multiple servers. Our 5M server is getting good already. You know, it's just a concept that you guys gotta be mature enough and all that. So, hope everything goes well in the future for my server and all that. So, stay tuned uh, for next other parts. And yeah. So, this Brady dude, like I said, um,. He, he said multiple lies. Multiple lies. Which I confronted him, you know. 
And I told him, you know, now he says I have a gun pointed in the head. And I told him, no, there's no need for that. There's no need to argue because your role got taken away. And I told him, my, like I said, multiple complaints, multiple issues, and, you know, yeah, and lying about things. And yeah, my other administrator told me all this, and there was another member. He made a member leave because he broke David's law, and nobody did nothing about it. And I had no idea why, and uh, it's because it, it, it just happened at night, which I said I was asleep and all that. But, you know, we're working on things and situations now, so I hope everything goes well in the future. And, yeah.